Hello, we are doing a video. I'm Vanessa. And I'm Adam. And on our Twitch stream, we decided to dig a 10x10 hole from the top of a mountain all the way down to bedrock. It was our first time on Hardcore and we were poor, so we wanted some resources. Did it work? Are we cash rich? Was this a good way of doing it? Or did it go horribly wrong? Spoiler alert. Roll the video. Bruh. We started off the stream by emptying our inventory, making all the tools we needed, using up all of our iron, and uh, we had one diamond pickaxe on us. And I hid, I think we had six or nine diamonds, which I hid in a different chest because I didn't want to use them. Sent Steve to bed, get a good night's sleep. And then in the morning, woke up and headed off, sent him to the mine. Yeah. See what he could do. We wanted to sort of, so we've got, we're, we're on top of a mountain, our, our base, our hardcore base on top of a mountain. So we thought we'll go just next to where we are and kind of map out a 10 by 10 area where we can dig down. We wanted it to be neat so we could sort of see where we're starting and see how to dig down and things. Yeah, and um, we built we built up kind of initially we built like a wall around it, and then uh, in a bit you'll see that we went to fencing just so we don't fall in when we're just knocking about the world. Yeah, it's got to be safe. And to be honest, digging out a ten by ten, like mapping it out, was surprisingly difficult. <laughs> yeah, I lost the ability to count for a little while, as you can <laughs> see here. So I sort of I dug down a little bit, filled it back in, dug down again, filled it in, threw your shovel for a little bit. Didn't didn't need that again. First time playing Java. First time playing on a PC. Yeah, First time true. playing hardcore, I sort of, uh, I kept getting mixed up. I think it's the E button and you just throw whatever you've got in front of you. Definitely still getting used to the controls a bit. And then yeah. here where there's like a very mini cliff we wanted to build up. Just as we said, so we can see it and sort of map it out properly. Make it look nice. Yeah. Pretty. We wanted to start with like a flat surface. So you, we're just building walls so mobs can't get us. Yeah, because we realised, firstly, we don't want to fall in the hole when it's done and we're just continuing in our world we don't want creepers falling in the hole we yeah just... you were pretty terrified of the creepers coming I was, in, right? yeah i didn't want like a waterfall of mobs while we're just digging down yeah my shovel broke in a second and we just uh carried on with our hands because shovels are just i they don't know why so yeah quick. the durability is so bad maybe it's because we were using stone it probably is because we're using stone but there well, you go we were poor weren't we this is why we were doing this we needed some stuff yeah Back to base to fill up on stuff. We did it. We ended up bringing the bed in, didn't we? Shortly. Yeah, yeah. And you need a surprising amount of chests because where are you going to put all the cobblestone and stuff that you're getting? Oh yeah, yeah. So we built. I, I think we made eight or nine chests, something like that. Yeah, and doubled them up. And we started off putting them in the mine, like you put one in it. That wasn't a very good idea. Nor was putting the um the table there. The <laughs> Well, what you don't realise is what is the bottom of your hole quickly becomes the top of your hole. Yeah. <laughs> and then the uh, the crafting table was very high up, so we had to had to retrieve that. But yeah, this is it. This is the beginning of the hole. You can sort of see it taking shape now. Yeah, we sort of get into it a little bit here. We um, were really into how good it looked because you literally filled in a space there that you're just about to dig out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, get that hole. Don't want that. There we go. Now it's all safe. Uh, without the fences yet, but we did. We, I think we put them in pretty shortly. First bit of stone as well. Yeah. Already having to dig around the crafting table. That was uh, that was not a good idea. Yeah. No. But yeah, that's the shape of it. So then it's just that. But then it goes down to uh, the bedrock. Was the aim? That was the plan. That was the plan. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Getting it all nice and level. Looks aesthetic. Got to got to look L good as well. Lovely bit of dirt there. I mean, how good can a big hole look? Fantastic. Well, apparently. yeah, we can we can make it look good. There we go. Getting the fences. Yeah, this is when we decided, like, we really didn't want the creeper waterfall, so fences were a necessity. I think I made necessity. far too many fences here. Was it a controller thing? Was it a getting used to? No maths. It was quite late at night, and I just <laughs> uh, I just forgot how to count briefly. It was really late at night, actually, wasn't it? Yeah. We were bored, and we were like, we dig two bedrooms. I think we put a gate on it at one point uh, before we decided. Before we realised how we're really going to get down into the hole, uh, pre-making the ladder, I think we maybe put a gate in, and I, can't, I don't really know why. I don't know. Let's time lapse it. Yeah, we'll stop when we get to some good bits. Yeah. Our first door, coal.
we dug into a cave here. There was a few enemies, it wasn't too bad. We just blocked it off and then got to it a little bit later and carried on. Cave, good, helpful, because it's already dug, isn't it? But mobs, mobs not good, mobs bad. Yeah, luckily we didn't We didn't even have to fight any. We just, uh, he burnt up in the sun. Yeah, because we opened it up, but then Creeper. Yeah. And you know how we feel about them. Just block them off and then we're all good. Deal with it later. The future Adam and Vanessa problem. After an hour or so of mining, Kat remembered that we had the diamonds. So we were strongly persuaded to uh, turn them into pickaxes and enchant them to speed up the process. And I was absolutely fine with them using my diamonds. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. We made a few pickaxes, all with efficiency on them. And then we started mining again at much faster speed using my diamonds. So after a few more hours, we made it to level 10. This is where we were going to start getting the diamond and all the good ores and stuff. Lava drama though, see it in the corner. Yeah, so we saw some lava, so we went and got a load of sand and the idea was we were just going to fill the lava pit with sand and then just dig it all out with a spade. Yeah, drop the sand in it and it sinks to the bottom, so good technique because then you it soaks up all the lava and then you just dig it away with a spade. Yeah, excellent techers, as you said. <laughs> so it was working. It worked, it worked pretty well, didn't it? You just throw a load of sand in and then it, it um, overwrites all the lava blocks and then when you get rid of all the lava, just dig it all out. Yep. And then we can get down to level zero. It was one or two deep in a lot of places. Some places it was a bit deeper. We were, we were pretty confident with it, to be honest. We had enough sand. Yeah, loads of sand. You can see there we've got 58 uh, iron so far. No diamonds, no lapis or anything, but we were, I'm guessing we were going to get some. Yeah, yeah, we're in, in the good levels at this point, level 10 and below, could find some stuff. Couldn't, yeah, couldn't quite it. reach across there, so I do, go, I do go around and attack it from the other side. <laughs> attack it from the other side, yeah. <laughs> kill it, kill it with sand. I had a bucket of water. I was just going to dump a load of water on there and then dig out the obsidian. But I thought that's going to take a long time. We probably did have enough diamond pickaxes to do it, to be honest. Maybe, but if they ran out, we didn't have any more. So the sand seemed like a safer bet. Yeah, this is when I realised I was actually putting sand in the bits we didn't even care about. Yeah, there was a big cave of lava, wasn't there? Not in our hole, that bit. So we uh, ordered that off. Don't need to deal with that. Yeah, and then crack on, get it done. I was expecting some diamonds. I know we weren't going to get loads of diamond, but I was expecting some. Because at this point, we've got zero diamond now. We've only got diamond pickaxes. So in order to continue, we really do need to get some more diamond. Yeah. And if you're strip mining, you go through a lot more than just a 10 by 10, don't you? You'd cover a lot more area than that. So much more likely to find it. Yeah. We quickly realized this wasn't the most efficient way to mine resources. I was just trying to get an idea here of where the lava went to. Oh, right, where it ended, how much danger we were in. I wanted to get the hole down to level 10. A nice, flat, even level 10. Yeah, yeah. A little bit of redstone. That's our first redstone we saw, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. And uh, we used up all our iron pickaxes by now. And one of our diamond, uh, and then we're on our three enchanted. So I think we'd used, we'd, we'd destroyed one, and then I kept, there was two more that were red. And I was thinking we could use an anvil so we didn't have to use as much. Oh, uh, yeah, but they were back. a few hits away from disappearing. Yeah. It turned out it was a huge lava pit that covered most of our hole. Or it felt like that. Maybe it was only half, but it felt like it was most of it. <laughs> I think it probably was most of it. Um, but we can jump over to the stream audio now. Yep. I might uh, have to bleep some words. See what happens. Okay. I'm holding shift as hard as I can. And we need to go around the 10 by 10 under here. 
the hole said no diamonds for you. It did. Unfortunately. I moved the camera to the other dog. Look at her. <gasps> oh, what the oh. hell? What happened? Uh, build down. Yep. Oh, and then no, water bucket yourself. I'm dead. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> what happened? Did you fall off into the lava? I was holding shift. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I'm more gutted that we didn't get to the bottom of the hole than we did the like the base Fuck and the progress me. that we've lost. <laughs> I was holding shift. Maybe you pressed it. Like you undid it, you know, you pressed it again and undid it. So, so that was the end. That was the end of our hardcore world. 70 odd, I think 70 something days in. Look at this hole, it's so deep. Level 10 is far down. We did well. Yeah, we jumped into creative after to see our progress. There Best you go. The chat. There he is. That's where it happened. Yeah, we started the new world. Uh, come check us out if you want. Straight away, back on the horse. Yeah, uh, yeah, come check us out. Twitch.com. Twitch.tv slash doing a video. Twitch.com, is it? Maybe. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much for watching our uh, peril. All right. See you soon. Bye-bye.